but that's what I think the parents like they talk 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 about their kids and it's like it's like if they get drafted their ego is fed oh yeah it's almost like getting a tattoo you know we asked this question one day if you get a tattoo why but if you got a tattoo guys it's okay yeah <laughs> i'm just saying it for myself like my perspective of that is like if someone gets a tattoo i go well, who is it for really who's it for is it for you does that the the mom yeah mom or the sail sh- you know the ship on your arm like that's a yeah. old school yeah, yeah, yeah is that is that for you like does it mean that much or is it for someone else yeah right yeah, is it for the look? Is, is it, it for, for the, the look? Is it for, are you trying to yeah, the make, reputation? Yeah. So, anyways, the ego is 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 if you get remove your ego and just let your kid be who he is and figure things out, that's the game changer. Mm-hmm. Like as far as like having him go through because the parents are crushed. The kids figure it out. Oh. The parents, I I, I oh, mean, I've, I've got a couple that say, you know hockey sucks, blah blah blah. It's not fair. Like I got that in my notes. So it's not fair. Bunch of bullshit. It's, no, it's not bullshit. Yeah, it's not. You looked at your son. With with uh, rose colored glasses, yeah. It's 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 not what you thought he was going to be. Mm-hmm. Well, they could have taken him instead of someone else. Yeah, they could have. Yeah. But the twenty teams went fifteen rounds. And they didn't choose him, or they chose him at a certain point. They thought these guys were better. Like, it's it's as fair as it can be. Yeah. Because well, if you're that good, like the politics in hockey, like we talk about this all oh, the time. Yeah. There's there. I always say there's no politics in hockey. And people go, yeah, but I go, okay. Let's say there is a little bit of politics in hockey. But you know who it doesn't apply to is the best player. Oh. It just doesn't apply. If Never. you're the best player, you get to play, you get drafted, you get to move on. Mm-hmm. That's it. That's all. There is no politics with that. Just yep. like any other company. Yeah. Well, the well, the politics thing is so funny. That that one strikes one for me. I remember yeah. that that when uh, when I was a kid, like yeah. the the parents that think, oh man, like there's this guy's trying to screw me this way and that way, yeah. and it's not fair and all this stuff. Yeah. There couldn't be a more objective measure of what where your kids are at right now than than that draft right in a lot of ways in some ways no but in some ways yes right so because if you if you think about what the process is for some them to select your kid like i was saying and maybe people didn't know this before hearing us talk about it true these these gms and scouts they don't know the kids they don't care they don't they're not researching these kids day in and day out know everything about every kid the way you do and the, the way that you're paying attention right so they're solely basing what they know on their game performance and the buzz they're creating on the ice. Yeah. They don't have any and other And some measure. background checks to make some sure he hasn't checks. robbed banks and right. he's not a serial killer. Exactly. And but they don't know every kid on every team inside, inside. a serial killer. Probably not a serial killer. <laughs> assuming, he's, assuming he's not a serial killer, <laughs> right? Yeah. But that that's that's the extent of, of their knowledge about, like, so what? where are the politics? There's none. There, where, where? Now, now, okay. Now I have seen right. Of I, course. Okay, so this is a beautiful thing. Like I've seen dads beg to be a scout. No, yep. just at the time. Oh yeah, that their son's getting drafted, yeah. and coach the team just at that time. Or and they rich try to dad make buy the, the team. Rich guy buy yeah. the team, and then they try yeah. to pull all the strings. But I mean, and I've seen that happen where kids, the kid's nephew or or someone that's involved in a team takes their kid in a ex, whatever round it is and it makes everyone feel good. But again, that's the ego. Does that really make you feel good that you did, like for example, if if you did become the scout or you became owner of the team and stuff and then you, you, your kid got drafted in the 12th round, mm-hmm. does that, if that makes you feel good, I mean, I guess well, like you got different issues than I do. Well, and it, I don't want to disc because that does. You're right. That does happen. But like, yeah, let's play, not often. But let's play percentage here, right? Yeah, like, yeah, what's yeah. Wh- what amount of that is occurring in the draft? Even if there's ten percent of that, yeah, right. Yeah. Which there's not. But yeah. even if there was that much, Does that make thirty kids. What's that? That would make thirty kids. What do you mean? Ten percent of three hundred, right? Oh yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> not bad, but dude. <laughs> <laughs> Even if there was, though, right, which is not, but right. even if there was, that's not a lot. No. So the vast, vast, yeah. vast majority yeah. of what happens in the draft yeah. is just an objective measure of who they think are yeah. the best kids, right? Yeah. And it could be that your kid is really better and had a really bad Marley's tournament or didn't play yeah. well in the playoffs. Right. And Doubt but, crept in. Yeah, right? And and maybe that is accounts for some of it as well, but it yeah. still doesn't matter. The vast majority of it is just who's the best right now, right? That's the mm-hmm. That is what it is. Yeah. Almost entirely. Who's the best right, right now? And what do I see him in three years? Yeah, that's what best it is. right now. Right, exactly. Yeah. Who's who's the best choice yeah. right now yeah. for reason X Y Z? Right. Yeah. So that's that's what it's about. So you want to talk about like the politics and hockey and how you're getting screwed and how not fair it is and all this and it's like just take a take a step back, man. 
Like yeah. take a look at what's at what's happening. Just step out of your little world of, you know, triple A zone or Waterloo regional triple A hockey or whatever it is that you're consumed by at the moment mm -hmm. and just like actually think about what it, what is going on. The adults that are picking your kids, like they have other things that are way more important than researching every yep. little detail. They're not trying to screw yep. you. You yep. know what I mean?